Over the last couple years, I've been using my Raptor toy hauler and I get a lot of questions from guys on what truck do I need to tow a toy hauler like yours. Well, a great resource for that is TrailerLife.com. They've got a full guide on what vehicle you need to tow whatever size toy hauler or trailer you're looking at. But remember, it's not about really towing it, it's about being able to stop that big rig because a toy hauler that's 15, 18,000 pounds, having to stop that thing in an emergency situation, you wanna make sure you have plenty of truck. So TrailerLife.com is your resource for that. And another question I get is now that I have my truck, what's the best fifth wheel hitch to get? Now I'm going to save you a lot of time and a lot of money because I did a whole lot of research on this whenever we were buying a truck. I wanted a short bed truck with the bigger cab and a lot of people told me I could not do that. The combination would not work with a toy hauler and a hitch if I had the short bed truck. I talked to B&W and they said the thing that I needed was the slider hitch because that was going to make all the difference in the world and for me, I'm glad I went that direction because as soon as I slide that hitch back, it almost makes it like a long bed truck and I can make any hairpin turn I want without running a toy hauler into the cab of my truck. Another nice thing is the head pivots on the B&W hitch. So if I'm in a bind, the head will pivot, it's on a cam, I can unlock the jaws and I can pull right out. Same way as if I'm backing up into it. If it's on a bit of an angle, it'll back right up and hook up and I don't have to worry about keeping the truck and the trailer perfectly level to make sure that I can hook and unhook. And besides that, the best part is B&W trailer hitches are made right here in the USA.